Blerio is a three-year-old Poussier Breton who was sent to us from France. He had run away with a log behind him at home, and as his owner wants to give rides with him back in France, he needed to be safe, confident and happy in what he was being asked to do. This film shows some of the things he has achieved during his training with us. When we break horses to harness, we teach them to cope with many different hazards because we believe this gives them a good initial preparation for what they may encounter in their future driving careers. Here we are showing that Blerio can now be cantered in harness, showing that he is not frightened of the carriage behind him. We also take him on grass, in a big open field, to show that he will behave just in a rubber bit, in an environment which can be exciting to horses. He will trot happily away from home when asked. We then ask him to canter towards home. Although using the reins on a horse's quarters is not considered technically correct, because Blerio had had an incident at home prior to coming to us where he bolted with a log on the long reins, we are demonstrating that he will not panic or kick back when the reins flap about around his quarters in the carriage. This is an unusual feeling for a horse, so again, just like using the whip on their quarters and not only on their shoulders, we believe horses should be prepared for plenty of different things, not just what is considered normal. Fletcher then asked Blerio to stop and stand still before asking for a rein back. Bear in mind that all this is being done just in a soft rubber bit. Here Blerio is doing the hazards in our arena. If you plan to go to a showground with your horse, they could have stalls, flags, bunting, crowds of people, maybe even bottles left on the floor that your horse or carriage could step on and it would make a noise. This is why we ask them to step over the barrels. They get caught up around the horse's feet and make a noise. As the horse goes over them, and also as the carriage passes over them behind, which is not the noise that the carriage normally makes. However, you can see Blerio remains calm. If you go to a driving trials event, again you could encounter unusually decorated obstacles in bright colours, often with flags around the obstacles or brightly painted signs. In indoor trials you can also encounter pedestrian crossing mats, which we ask him to go over here. If you are giving rides to tourists, they could have rustling shopping bags. All of these things the horse needs to be prepared for, and we believe it is better to do this during their initial training. We also take Lerio over the bridge in our field. This shows that he is confident enough to walk onto a different surface as well as over the echoing bridge. Blerio's owner came over from France to drive him prior to his return home.
We also drove Valerio as a pair. Trandon. and in a team. All this helped to improve his confidence, both with other horses around him and when he is out in single.